Howdy y'all and welcome back to another game with Fritterbug Gaming and today's game is Slime Rancher. I know last week we were continuing off trying to collect the keys and trying to figure out where the keys are located but for this week uh, we actually wound up getting some downloadable content that was free on Steam so we thought well why not show it off. Not really sure what all it has in it, but it does have two different packs in it, one including a chroma, and the other is something to do with the galactic. I'm not really 100% sure with what it is yet, but I figured we could find out once we got into game. All right. Anything new here? Let's see. Hmm. I wonder if I go inside if that will work with the chroma. Let's see. Manage DLC. There we go. Let's see. We've got the Galactic playset includes an exclusive Galactic fashion pod and a beeper bot slime toy. And it says you can access the fashion pod under, after unlocking Slime Science in the lab. Slime toys can be accessed after unlocking them via 7ZEE -E Rewards Club. And we've also got the Ruby Chroma Pack. It says includes an exclusive Ruby Chroma Pack that you can apply to your VAC Pack, Ranch Tech, or Ranch House. You can access Chroma Packs after unlocking the Chroma Station from the Z 7ZEE -E -E Rewards Club. All right, so we've got, let's see if it's in here. I don't have enough for that, so we'll have to go and earn up some money to get into that. Though it does seem like it's getting pretty late in the day on here, so let's try to collect up some foods. You guys seem to have been fed very well, but I've only got two boom ports. Okay. We've got some rock slime ports as well. Tabby ports. And I don't think we've got any... Oh, yes, we do. We have our water ports out here. So we'll have to go out there and collect them. I did forget that we've opened up about every area now on our farm. I mean, there is still one little area we still have to unlock. But that's coming up later. So don't worry, guys. You will get to see that later on in the series. As soon as we earn up enough for it. Hey guys, how y'all doing today? Y'all ready to give me a few ports? No? Nothing today? Well that's fine, I'll be back in a moment then. Like some little chicken friends. Nope. Hey, you, I hear you. There we are. Now that we've got us a couple chickens, we can feed our tabby plorts, our tabby slime, some more, as well as our. Oh, well, we got some carrots and pogo fruits that we didn't need. Haha, uh -huh, now we don't. I love it how this area over here is just like a little area for chickens. They spawn naturally, and a, quite a bit of them to be exact. As you can tell, more just spawned. But, 
We are going to use these slimes for our tabby as well as for our boom slime, so that way we can possibly collect some more plorts out of it. Seems like this one's pretty happily fed right now, so we don't need to feed it. But we will need to give some more to these slimes. Let's see, you've got the red ones right now. Oh. That'll save me on having to go out and collect more for this area. But it does look like these guys have multiplied and I'm not quite sure how they have. Let's see, we got veggies over there and fruits over here. I'm sure we haven't fed either one of them, but those guys seem to be very happy, so whatever we're doing there must be working. Collect them off the tree as well. That way we won't be missing out on any of them. Ooh. Okay, and you are still growing pogo fruit, which is a plus. Let's check on the heartbeats. They're good still. Okay, now let's head back down into the cavern and feed the other two slimes that we have down there. The rad slimes, and I believe those are called philosopher slimes. The heartbeats. Let's give these guys a few. There we go. It's probably more than a few, but oh well, whatever works. Okay, and we'll feed these little guys as well. Alright, so now... Ooh. Lots and lots of florts. You gotta love the flort season. Grabbed one of your pogo fruits. There we go, guys. Okay, so we've got nine of the philosopher plorts and nine rad plorts. So that should bring us in a pretty penny. Have you guys given me any more? Uh, just a few. But it works better than not having any. Oh, wait, wait, wait a minute. You, you're changing the prices up on the market as I'm selling? Now that just isn't right. So all the ones I have in my inventory are the ones your prices just went down on. You guys just stink. Now let's take one more trip over here and see if our water slimes have let off any plorts. It does look like it. This one's carrying one of its plorts. Okay, so we've got a few puddle plorts, but not many. Maybe though they will bring in a good chunk of money for what they are. <clears throat> I don't know, I didn't really look at it real good before I left it, so...
Ooh, they are up in sales. 43 a plort. So that's good. Well, we're not up where we need to be yet, but that is fine. Let's see. Hmm. All right. So we've got other stuff over here that we can use. What all are you asking for? Yes, I don't have that many. I think I've stated that in the last episode, though. <clears throat> all right. So let's see if we can get lucky and find some ports while we are out. Oh, these guys do not look very happy. Hey there, little guys. How you doing? Well, I'm doing good. Nice to talk to you. Hey there, leave my ports alone. Ooh, a box. So we didn't get much out of that box, but at least we got a few things. Okay. Well, guess what? We're going to send these guys off with a good little snack. There we go. And now we can grab something else while we're out. Nothing over here. Oh, there are a lot of transforming little slimes over here, so this is a pretty dangerous little area. This is usually the most dangerous of the areas, in my opinion. I can't collect those. Let's see, we don't need. Oh, there he is. See, I knew it. Well, that is wonderful. He's right behind me, isn't he? Make sure I didn't have one extra to deal with up there. Maybe if we're lucky, we won't have to deal with any more of those for a little while. Aha! Oh. Why can I not collect the golden slime? Oh. So, I guess I did it wrong. Okay. Guess from now on, I'm going to carry around a chicken with me. Alright, I need to find out where one of these keys are. Cause I happen to need a key to get through this extra door over here. tree is stopping me. Is that right? Oh, why not?
All right. <clears throat> so at least we picked us up a few more roosters. We needed those because we didn't have any in our one pin that we have. So we've got that taken care of now. We didn't have any problems hatching chickens. Goodness, they just bounce in there, don't they? Maybe they won't age too fast, but you never know. And we collected 18 plorts while we were out as well. Let's see how much is it for this area. <clears throat> the lab is 10,000 gold. So we're nowhere close to that right yet. But when we do collect that much, that will be our next target to buy. So now let's check into going the opposite direction and see if maybe there's somewhere over there that we haven't found a key. I mean, there could be one just laying around that we don't know about and we just haven't found it yet. And until we do, we are at a loss. Those guys never seem too happy to see me. Oh well, they'll get over it. Plenty of chickens over this way. But we need to find the access to the other doors that'll lead us to the other slimes. The slimes we haven't found yet. <coughs> All right, so is there anything over this direction? Let's see here. Our best bet would be being up in a high area. What was that? Ooh, a lot more of the water slimes. And the box. Might as well go for it. So an odd onion, a pogo fruit, and a heartbeat. Okay, that's awkwardly off. wonder what is this way. I think this is the area that we had to fly across. Ooh, but there is another box over there. Ooh, we got us another cloud ornament. Oh, 
Oh no, do not eat them. Well, at least I got a few of the Okabokas. Maybe we can get up to a higher point up here. Oh, we almost made it. Let's give it a few moments and let that reset. And then we can fly our way up. Ooh, what is this little area? Ooh, and big tabby. Just, not a big tabby, but a, a Largo slime. And he likes veggies. So, we're going to have to collect a lot of veggies to get to this one. Hmm, I don't know if we've got that many veggies at our base, but maybe if we're lucky, we can find some around here. So, this is where I'm located. Should be easy enough to find it. Oh, you guys are not very friendly, are you? Oh my, oh no. And you guys are rad slimes as well. Ooh, heartbeats. Like, oh yes, you can eat your nice sl slime food and uh, leave me alone. Yeah, <laughs> Yeah, you go back that way. Ooh, what's through here? Have we been through here? I don't know. You never know until you follow along and see where it takes you. Ooh, and we've got another Largo slime. Yay, a rad slime, which means we're going to need some veggies as well. So, we're going to have to head back and collect up as many fruits and as many veggies as we possibly can and make our way back over here. Hmm. Okay, so let's see if we can find an easy way back to base. I know we had a teleporter somewhere close to here. Aha, I think I was correct. So this teleporter over here should take us straight back to base. Yes, it did. So now all we have to do is come back this way to head back out there easy. All right, so let's head and grab our fruits, our veggies, and make our way back to the Largo Slimes. I sure hope the Largo Slimes are the way of collecting the keys. So we've got a rock Largo to feed as well as a rad largo to feed. I don't think we've got any plorts right now. We do have one hen hen. There we go. We've put that in there. So I feel like it would only be wise if we did this and stuck our cloud ornament right there and the green ornament right beside it. Whoops. Well, hello. You pulled off more than I expected. Oh well, that works. <laughs> they may be a little squished together, but it works right now. Alright, so let's see what we've got on our call for today. Thora West. Ah, uh, no, Mama Sweets are currently taken. And as of those tabby slimes, those are going to be hard for me to gather for you, so I do apologize. But I don't believe this will be enough to feed the Largo slimes. It means we're going to have to go out and actually scavenge for more food.
Well, I do think I know of a few places we can go to grab some carrots as well as some um, pogo fruit. So we'll go that way first. Now, wait a minute. How did you get out of your little pen? Eat your fruit. And hush. Well, you're on chickens, it looks like. Alright, so we know that the pogo fruit grow out here. Looks like we can collect our puddle quartz while we are at it. Well, that's always fun and pleasant. Come on, give me the carrot. There we go. Okay, none on up there on that tree. None on that tree as well. Oh, Mr. Chicken, you got me a pogo fruit, don't you? Carrots! Yay, okay, I don't need a chicken. One of those times when all you're after is the fruit and not the chickens. Does seem like a rare occasion, does it not? Any fruits above my head? There are. Wonder how many fruits and carrot and veggies it will take to feed those Largo slimes. Hmm. Well, I've got a few of each type of veggie, but I don't have many of the fruits. Well, I don't have as many veggies as I have fruits, actually. Ooh, more veggies. Fruits, I mean. Ah, I'm so backwards today. Doesn't look like anything else left on the ground. Nope. Ooh, here's some more pogo fruit. Okay, so let's go and collect us some carrots now. Should be able to find that in the first area of the outside the farm. I know that the pink slums were hovered around some. And here's a few as well, because these guys are not going to eat this many carrots. And I can always bring them more later. And of course we've got a little box when we can't afford to pick it up. We'll just leave that for next time when we come out. So that way we can collect that chest and see what's in it. <laughs> hey you guys, let me have these pogo fruits. Y'all get away from it. Flying slimes. There we go. That's my pogo fruit. Ah! Fighting you guys is something else. Nope, too late. Can't grab that. Alright, so let's go and grab these carrots that are over here. I wonder if 40 of each of the fruits and veggies would be enough to make them explode. Because if so, then we have enough right now. Alright, so let's go ahead and head back with our fruits and veggies. And let me check the time real quick, see where we're at. All right, so we've got a couple more minutes, not long at all. So let's go ahead and see if we cannot head up to the Largo Slimes and get one of them, one or two of them to explode right fast for us so we can gather the items that we need. So our put puddle ports before we leave. Because knowing me, I'd probably forget where these Largo slimes are located before I could even make it out there. 
And then it would be just nothing but trouble. I have a feeling. Where did I come in at? Let's see. Hmm. I don't even remember. I bet she was through here. That one isn't the right one, but maybe the one that's out here is. See where this takes us. Well, the wrong area completely. Nice. Okay, so where is our other little teleporter at? I do believe it's down in the cave. But where does that area take us? I forgot. Hmm. And guys, don't be uh, afraid to check out my Little Nightmares video. I will be posting a new one today. So you guys can check that out later on. I know we're getting closer to the end in that game, so it would be awesome to show it to you guys. Haha, <laughs> exactly where we wanted to go. Wonderful. Alright, so now all we have to do is get back to those few slimes, a few Largo slimes that we did see, and then we will be able to most definitely, well, hopefully, get us another key with two Largo slimes. One of them is bound to have a key in them. Let's see, so where do I head first? We went up here. Okay. But where did I go from here? Oh my, that's a lot of black slimes. And I am so sure that those guys are very happy to see me. Because I do believe I am their favorite meal. <clears throat> oh, goodness. Alright, so we will take care of our rock friend first. Let's go ahead and give you the heartbeats. Because we brought some extras with us. Oh, okay, well, you obviously didn't want those, huh? Ooh, a box that was about to break. And all kinds of rock slimes. Oh, and we've got another cloud ornament. How wonderful. Though we don't want the rock slime. So, fun voyage, my rocky friends. Splash, 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 splash. Alright, now we're good. Nothing else? Nope. Okay, so time for the next Largo slime. Oop, 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 I'm falling, I'm falling. Whoop, oop, oop. No way I'm going to get back up there now. Oh, well, I don't know where it took me. Wherever am I? I did not even know that I was close to a portal. Alright, so now all we have to do is make our way over here to the area that we found the Largo slimes, the Largo slime last time. Uh, 
Okay, so it wouldn't be that way. We had to have come this way, and yes, straight through here is where we found the other slime. Oh yes, this is going to be very dangerous. Hello, Mr. Slime. You like veggies. I thought you said, it said you liked fruits. Well, the problem is I don't think I'm going to have quite enough. How am I getting radiation sickness from... Oh, he's growing. So his radiation area is too. That is not good. That's not good at all. Oh, well, there's a carrot I can give him. Hmm. Let's see. Maybe if I'm lucky, the area that I came in before coming in here will have something he might like. Okay, leave the room, leave the room. Okay, as fast as we can. Maybe if I'm lucky, I can find some carrots out here or something of the such that I can feed it. Let's see. Well, if so, they have cleared it out right now. So I'm going to have to wait until we log back on. But if you guys have enjoyed this episode, don't forget to hit that like, share, and subscribe. And turn on the bell for the notifications so that way you'll be notified anytime I upload a new video. And I will catch you guys in the next Slime Rancher. Bye!